A Tulsa man with cerebral palsy says he's reclaiming his freedom after the community raised enough money for him to buy a new wheelchair van. In a story that's positively Oklahoma, our Alexandra Blake shows us why this man is saying anything is possible. The van behind me started out as just a dream for Sean Lewis and his mom, Kyle Miller. On Friday, that dream became a reality. Awesome. Sean Lewis and his mom, Kyle Miller, getting the keys to their brand new wheelchair van. It's their first time with a push to start. Their last van about had to be pushed to start. Everywhere we go, uh, we just pray to make it there. Praying to make it safely with no heat or AC and a broken ramp forcing Kyle to lug around a portable one. It's very awkward and uh, heavy for one person to handle. Sean's life isn't easy, but Kyle says she's committed to helping her son live life to the fullest. He was born premature and he was diagnosed with cerebral palsy. So I was going to give him every opportunity to be as active and be involved. Involved in Paralympic sports and rolling through races. He's a motivational speaker and an active church member. So when the family van started breaking down, his life hit a speed bump. A family friend, Rachel Merton, started a fundraiser for some new wheels. With community donations revving along, Tulsa's Mobility One Transportation stepped in. A grand example of the things that we get to do for our customers. We get to participate in seeing life-changing events that make them where they can get out and be part of the world like the rest of us. Owner Todd Collier offered a special price on a van beyond Sean's wildest dreams and his favorite color, with Sean naming it Ruby right off the bat. In just six short weeks, the community raised the goal. Finally, you get to come home, Ruby. Sean and Kyle said farewell to a van they once called Old Faithful and hello to Ruby. Everywhere I go, people know it's me before I even get out of the van. Awesome. Sean Lewis says this is his first time in the passenger seat right next to mom. In Tulsa, Alexandra Blake, 2 News, Oklahoma.